Hi, I'm Morgan from Whole Latte Love. Today I've got a quick tip for you so you can practice your frothing technique without wasting any milk. I'm going to be using just some water and a little bit of dish soap. So what I'm going to do is just fill my pitcher with some water just below the spout. Okay, now I'm going to add just a little bit of dish soap. That's good. So even though we're just practicing, we want to go through all the motions as if we were actually frothing milk. So the first thing you always want to do is purge your steam on to get rid of any excess moisture. Okay. Now you want to submerge the tip of the steam wand below the surface. So we're going to start here, and once we have the steam on, we're going to lower the pitcher slightly until we hear the occasional rip, like a tss, tss. So when steaming for a latte, you want to get that air in right at the start and then get that roll going to incorporate it. In the end, what we're looking for is a nice shiny surface with no large bubbles. If you happen to get larger bubbles, that roll will break them up and mix them back into the milk. It'll look a little bit like latex paint. All right, now always make sure you wipe off your steam one when you're done. That looks pretty good. It's got the consistency we're looking for, nice and creamy and smooth, no large bubbles. If you have just a few little bubbles, just give it a knock and a swirl and it'll help get rid of those. So there you go, just some water and a little dish soap to help you become a frothing expert without wasting any milk. The number one source for everything coffee, wholelattelove.com.